Poots, and right now you're watching Streets is Talking on Hip Hop Wyatt. Peace. Slaves, like my big brother, you know, we family, we speak all the time. And the same thing with Buster, it's all love. I actually seen the other day at Summer Jam, and we, we, we spot, slept, shook hands, hugged, talked, kicked it, laughed, you know what I mean? It's all love. Yes, besides Remy, I don't have any genuine friends in this industry. You know, you use the word genuine, that's a serious word. So, you know, no. What made us decide, what made me and Remy decide to join the cast of Love and Hip Hop was actually looking into it for ourselves. Taking the words of others. Um, basically, it was always an interest for me to do love and hip hop, even when she was away. They wanted me to do it and kind of build up to when she comes home. And we held back on it because we wanted her to get out here first and really, you know, we can look at it and analyze it for ourselves. And um, we didn't see nothing wrong with it. We represent Black Love. You know what I mean, and we, we actually have been able to influence our culture. You know, if you take a look at what's going on now, but, you know, at one time it was just money over bitches. We don't love them hoes. Now everybody is starting to be coupled up and not hot and you know the fact that showing love to your significant other and I feel like me and Remy played a major part in being influential and all that to some. I feel like they need to be real with themselves and be real with everybody else. You know what I mean? I'm just happy to see that, you know, myself and Remy taking that stand and showing them don't be afraid. It's alright to say you love your girlfriend or your wife or whoever, you know what I mean? It's okay. It doesn't make you less of a man. I think until something is done about it, it's always gonna happen until someone really takes a stand Some of them in positions of power, so they use their power in a negative way. Um, people bad mouthing and telling other people who never met you you a certain way before you can even meet them and build a positive relationship. Things of that nature, just haters, man. People hating on me. I get a lot of haters because I'm real. I speak my mind, and I'm, I, you know, it's authentic with me. It's not sugar coated, and some people don't know how to deal with that. But people know when they're dealing with me, you just know under the table. If you do something sideways, I'm going to address you. So they, you know, they feel this be heard, so they can spread the word, spread the word.